the first descendant this is a new sci-fi shooter type game i've heard it's kind of like a destiny slash halo knockoff is what some people are saying that's not a bad thing to me that means that the game is going to have elements that i enjoy because i like both of those games i don't really know much about it beyond that um i saw this on tiktok i'm recording this on the night of july 4th um last night was uh i was on tiktok and i saw like four or five different people talking about this game and then today during the dragon age inquisition stream somebody said hey renfield are you going to play this game and try it out and i went i didn't know anything about it so i went and looked it up it's available as free to play title on PS5 console. It's Xbox Series X, PS5, Steam, everywhere. Um, I went ahead and just put it on the Xbox Series X because this is what I've got plugged in right now. And I just got home from being on the road. And I don't have everything all hooked up back in. So I didn't have the PS5 ready to go. And I've been playing some Xbox games the last couple of days. So we're trying it out on the Xbox Series X. Um, yeah, again, I don't really know much about it other than it looks like a cool sci-fi game, kind of like an anime style. Um, sometimes that means they're going to be lots of fat booty. And I know one of the things I was seeing all across TikTok last night was people oohing and aahing over some of the uh, costumes for the female characters. So we'll see what we see. Um, I've heard the writing is kind of mid, but the gameplay is pretty fun. Um, I've heard there's a um, little bit of jank with this uh, first launch version. I don't know that they patched it yet. It doesn't bother me. Um, we're going to jump in, see what we can see, have some fun, hopefully. Learn what's up with this world and why we're trying to save it. I saw everything. The connection between two worlds. About a century ago, humans were defeated by the Vulgus. Invaders from the other world. Then came the Colossi, who destroyed everything. Humans resisted until they could no longer. Then they found hope. How did they find hope? They were gifted the forgotten ancestors' power. Oh, so kind of like in Destiny Finally, when they get the light. I get it. Now I can see that's a parallel. But another threat had emerged. Karel, the new leader of the Vulgus. His dark ambitions are driving both worlds to the brink of collapse. We must fight back. With the ancestors' power bestowed upon us. Descendant, can you hear me? I've been waiting for you. Dun, 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 dun. So I'm the first descendant. Albion's command headquarters. According to the investigative core, the Ironheart is in the ruins. The assignment is simple. Bunny will collect it. Bunny. One of you protects her. So, who is going to take this on? Alright, so I've got three characters to choose from. Uh, view details of each descendant before choosing. The selected one will become your first descendant. Later you can gather descendant kits to collect and play various other descendants. Oh, there's more than just three heroes available. That's cool. So we've got Viesa, Lepic, and Ajax. Seems like my kind of job. Wouldn't it be easier if I just froze everything? That's, um, I'm forgetting her name from The Last of Us and Critical Role and Pillars of Eternity 2 and... Ah, um, Viesa is a debuffer uses chill at will. Lepic. I just need to blow up everybody except and a melee attack. Leave it to me. Ajax Spend is a tank. I don't want to play a tank. Um, I don't really feel the need to play a female character, although I realize that's the draw for many people who play these types of games because they do a great job with some of the outfits. Uh, and yeah, but 
I like my mail I'll carriers. Go. Cause I just need to blow up everybody except Bunny, right? That's how I roll. Let's do this. <laughs> that was a cheesy smile at the end, guys. Definitely feeling a uh, anime vibe. A little. Ah, oh, the artwork looks really cool. I like the art style. Definitely getting like a Halo slash Destiny vibe. Other than this is, you know, more of an anime style as opposed to the uh, Western house style that both of those games have. Oh yeah, look at those thighs. No iron on look that at the look either. at the cheese. This is the only place left. Let's yep. Over with. Yep. The this is one of those kind of games. Ah, it took ah. so many soldiers to find this place. Please let the Iron Heart be in here somewhere. I hope it's here too, Bunny. I'd like to give Albion some good news. Finding the Iron Heart is important, but so is retrieving it. The Volkus also have their sights set on these ruins. Eh, don't worry about that, Alpha. Compared to me, the Volkus are as slow as turtles. <laughs> I'll blow up anyone who comes for you, Bunny. <laughs> good to know you have my back. Right. So, do you know what the heart looks like? We'll know when we see it. Um, I need to speed up the, uh... Come on, hurry up! Yeah, 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 I'm getting there. Um, controller... That's better. I'll take the lead. Sounds good. Do that, Speedy. All right, we gotta Whoa. jump over. What the heck? What's going on? All operatives report. Oh no, I'm not gonna be able to follow her over. <sighs> we almost died. I'm okay, by the way. Roger that. Resume operation. Our path's been cut off. We better find a way around. Be there careful, was a buddy. barrier there. I Something guess that's like a, right. a story barrier. Damn it. It's the Vulgus. What? I'll come help. No need. I'll take him out, then join you. Well, as you can see, I'm a shit shot. I don't appear to be able to switch to other weapons at the moment with any of my abilities. I'm glad you're safe. Me too. But then again, I am me. Abilities, I mean, buttons. No like... need to brag. Come on, let's keep going. Y doesn't do anything. B doesn't do anything. A is jump. L, B, R, B. Okay, L, T, R, T. Whoa. What is all this? I don't know. It looks cool as hell, though. There's no way through. This is the only place left. There has to be something here. There was a hidden space. That's definitely something. <laughs> There's our destiny like orb. Is it going to talk to us? It's the Ironheart! Cover me! What is this? Getting a Death Stranding backpack vibe? Okay. So this is the Ironheart. We can close the dimensional wall with this, right? And when we have all three of them, we can stop the Colossi and the Volgus? How awesome is that? But does something feel weird to you? Well, there's creepy sound effects going on. 
Although... It feels like the Iron Heart is somehow calling to me. Oh, oh, oh. Uh. Time to take a little trip. Welcome, Chosen One. If there's a prophetic figure here in a minute calling me the Chosen One, I am gonna just... The, the writing is gonna go super meh, mid. I'll jump, double jump. Okay. Look at that, guide. Descendant, chosen one, the prophesied one, the true descendant. Oh my God! Why do so many? <sighs> you know that German director Werner? Uh, I'm blanking on his name. Show me the baby from the Mandalorian, right? The old German director. Um, he he had a talk one time where he was talking about. The, the three act structure that so many Hollywood films use, which makes them churn out absolute doggy do um, storylines. And I just feel that, like, the moment you tell me I'm a chosen one, a prophesied one, there's so sort of alien voice, floating light, angelic figure, uh, it's like the worst, cringiest story moment for me ever. Um,. the red okay why is the red dot jumping okay I'm guessing it's like it the red dot signifies where your grapples gonna go so if it's on the wall it's but if you get close enough to a ledge oh it does not automatically pull you up though Feels a little wonky that it doesn't. Um... Oh, okay. I was pushing forward. So you have to be pushing forward. That I feel like it would benefit from a auto, like an auto, uh, an auto grab, grapple. No, it's not grapple. What is the word for that? I'm blanking on the, the correct term for that. Traverse? Traversal? Parkour! That's a cool visual right there. Got a sun on the horizon. That's weird. Are we in like a robot space? It sounds very mechanical. Suddenly my weapon's gone? Or what? I hear this water underneath my feet. You're finally here. No! Why? Why does it always have to be an angelic figure? Remember Lost Ark? I, could, I had such a hard time with this, that because of the story. It does not bode well. I am your guide. I was created to guide the descendants to the Iron Heart. This is the connection procedure. Initializing process to access your consciousness. We both need the Iron Heart. I can help humanity. Descendant. Welcome to the Matrix, baby. <laughs> Bunny, 
Did you see the guide too? Yeah, I saw it. It took me to a weird place. Oh. Hold on. It's the Vulgus. They found their way here. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Run. Let's get out of here. Run. I seriously have no idea what's going on. Doesn't matter. Run. Target secured. I'm moving out. Yep. Yeah, it's closing us in. We have a lot to talk about. Oh, don't worry about me. Get out. The visuals are really sweet here. Oh, I'm like running fast, I guess because it's downhill. The Vulgus attacked. What's that sound? I have synchronized with your consciousness. Focus on the heart. It must not be captured. Why my aim is horrible. button to roll. Oh! Uh, roll. <laughs> okay. Press the Y button. It wouldn't let me change earlier. That must be part of the tutorial. I just feel like it's a, it's well reserve judgment. I'm still uh, trying to get used to the ah. It really needs an auto traversal thing for when you get on a ledge. Let's perform a sub attack. What does that mean? When it's on cooldown, swing your fire. Ability. Okay. Traction grenade pulls enemy to one location. Throw grenade. Overkill. Use the prosthetic arm as a weapon. You are under the influence of your unconscious mind. Test your limits. Where did this power come from? This no. is your true form. I'm gonna have to get a little better at that. Um, okay. Say yes, that's pretty cool. why they weren't coming for me. Ha ha ha. I've up died. 
It's been a while since your last report. Have you regrouped with money? I need confirmation. Roger that. Resuming operation. I'm at the rendezvous point. Bunny, where are you? Bunny! Shout if you can hear me! Quick commercial break, everyone, to celebrate and give thanks to all of these amazing people who keep me on the air full time. Really appreciate the support. All you got to do is join as a member. You get access to private videos. You can also do super thanks on any upload or super chats and stickers on any live stream or premiere you see. And beyond that, don't forget we're multi streaming over on Twitch now, so you can support over there as well. Thanks so much to everybody. Let's get back to the video at hand. Well, I hear gunfire, but no bunny. That's pretty cool looking, man. I can dig it. Oh, who? Oh, is this the leader? Oh, wow. He's got superpowers. Get over here. Why did he call her Angris? And he ripped the... Oh! Oh! Some Colossus body parts can be removed, and it's showing me something up top, like a shoulder pad. Pressing the R button use it to use Ekibe to split. Ekibe. Okay. I'll have to try to remember that. How the hell do I... Ah. 
Aha! Hold on. And then jank, jank. Satisfactory. Alpha, the Iron Heart was stolen. The operation failed. Damn it! I never expected Corel to show up in person after everything we've gone through to find that Iron Heart. If we don't find the other two Iron Hearts before he does, the dimensional wall will be in danger. Don't lose hope, HQ. We've made contact with a guide. She's going to help us. Is she now, and can she be trusted? Uh, Albion, neutralize weight experiment dimension. Zealots respawn in their original location after the interim review. That's a cool piece of concept art. Definitely voice. like Destiny. I need your help. Humanity requires my help. Because you've got a central hub. The Iron Heart. Enzo. Yep. Did you hear Boops. that voice? Look at that, yeah, look at that. I heard it too, Bunny. All over the place. I need to explain the situation to Alpha. You should go and get treated. What? Can't Alpha hear the guide's voice? I don't hear anything at all. It seems to only be linked to active descendants. Active descendants. Now, are there any other descendants who have had contact with the guide? Aside from Jeremy, all descendants have reported connecting with the guide. And the descendant who first made contact with the Iron Heart will be arriving at HQ shortly. When it comes to the guide, we have to consider all possibilities. Make sure you familiarize yourself with everything. Copy that. All right, search info. A device that connects various parts of the Ingress continent. Oh, so you can change difficulty even? I just want a normal open portal. Okay, so we're currently in Albion. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine zones. There are many types of facilitators. Hover your cursor over icon. You can also check the legend. Okay, yeah, this is just like Destiny. Cool. Well, that means it's familiar. We got a mailbox. Big gunk droid. Oh, we got some tokens. Um, I'm gonna not take those quite yet. Because I don't want an XP boost until I know what I'm doing. Infiltration terminal. Well, let's ignore all this and let's just head to our main quest objective and then we'll worry about the other stuff later. Looks like we're going in this direction. Dude, this place looks pretty awesome. Also, you know, uh, Anthem, you know, another fun lobby based game that unfortunately didn't make it too far, but I still had fun playing it. To those descendants who have connected to me, thank you for answering my call. This is Albion, the last bastion of humanity. Of course it is. Many lives have been laid before the Iron Heart. I wish to help humanity. My system can locate the Iron Heart. However, my functions were damaged after I was separated from it. If I can access the data left by my creators, the ancestors, I should be able to find a way to restore my system. I appeal to all descendants who can hear my voice. Please help me to restore my system. Take me 
to the ancestors' facility. So that's going to be the first a system that can find the Ironheart. What is it exactly? Alpha, it looks like the guide is speaking to another descendant nearby. I've uploaded the details of the conversation to the command console. Hmm. Based on this, the guide seems to be more AI than a spiritual being. Any descendant who's been contacted by the guide, please report to HQ immediately. Nell, as a non-descendant, how do you feel about this phenomenon? I believe it holds sufficient strategic value to be of interest. Well, we're about to find out more. Alright, Nell is pretty cool looking. Um, actually, Nell is flat out hot. Big fan of Nell, not gonna lie. Executive officer at Albion headquarters. Definitely my type. Um, Enzo, who are you? You look cool. All right. Got a question about the operation? Okay. Hmm. I didn't expect you to be speaking to the guide. I thought you were headed straight to HQ. Well, first off, well done on the mission. It was a difficult one. Corel showing up in person, even I was concerned. Since your operation, a strange phenomenon has affected descendants. When you said there was hope, were you talking about the guide? To be honest, I suspect that the guide is either a new vulgus weapon or a new enemy. It's clever claiming to be able to find the Iron Heart for us. Who wouldn't want to believe that, if they're desperate enough? That is how traps are laid. Everything has a price. My staff officers, however, seem to have a different opinion. Enzo and Nell have proposed verifying the guide's credibility by fulfilling her requests. And the truth is, we currently lack any leads on the Ironheart. Enzo and Nell have determined that if the Guide can close the gaps in our knowledge, it will be worth it. Luckily, there is an Ancestor's facility within the territory we occupy. We plan on making contact with the Guide there. Descendant, this is your next mission. I would like you and Bunny to bring the Guide to the Ancestor's facility in Kingston. Deploying the Descendants who have been in closest contact with the Ironheart is our best bet. Bunny? I know you're recovering from your injuries, but I'm sure you understand the importance of this. I'll order the Investigative Corps to provide support. I hope we see some results, whatever the outcome may be. Bunny, you'll need to equip a new suit before you leave. I've already notified the Ordnance Department. The new suit? Uh, it won't be taken out of my pay, right? It will be deducted from your pay, naturally. Damn it. There's a whole bunch of bunnies that just showed up, so I'm assuming you can play bunny at some point. Plus, up to access the world map. Check the train emission locations. Move the desired area through the outpost. Check the mission start location for these icons. The next battlefield will open once 100% progress is reached. Check the required mission. Okay, that's Battlefield, Battlefield Progress. There's public or private mode for the zone you wish to enter. Private allows you to play alone or with a party, while public allows you to play with other players. Okay, so we would need to go to the outpost. How do I change... Did it automatically put me in to a private or a public? Pip in. My poor cat, she's so tired of having these collars on and everything else. Alright, so I arrived on a teleport pad. So from here, it's going to be just like every other looter shooter, you know, 
Halo multiplayer co-op, Destiny 2 co-op. Welcome. Descendant. This is the guide. Suddenly, she's. I, I can see her now. Please do not be alarmed. My appearance has been configured to facilitate communication. Of course, it has. I am linked to the Arche of Descendants. I can appear wherever you may be. But I am incomplete. At present, only you, descendant, can see or hear me. I need you to help me fully restore my system. And my double Ds. Only then can I help humanity. Ah, there you are. I'm Marcus from the Investigative Corps. I have orders from HQ to escort you, Descendant. This way, please. Alright, so here we've got... What is this? It's a storage box. A workbench. Ooh, so I can... Enhance my gear. I need to get ranks though. Plenish supplies. Oh, that's for like grenades and stuff. Ammo. Okay. got stuff to explore from here um i've got enough to do my first impressions so far um definitely get a destiny halo anthem vibe not a bad thing i had fun in all of those games i like those games um the controls are a little the way they do the abilities with the lba and stuff that'll take a little bit of getting used to I'm intrigued. The writing is mid. I'm I'm trying really hard not to cringe at the whole ghostly angelic guiding figure who tells me that I'm the one, you know, uh, with the special power that's going to save everybody. Um, that always makes me cringe as just as a writer. But the gameplay is fun visually. It is absolutely stunning. Um, I don't know if anybody out there is playing this on the PS5. Does it have haptic feedback for the controls on the PS5? Because I'm playing it on the Xbox Series X. I just got home from my trip, so I didn't have time to like get all my new hardware set up because I brought home a new thing and I set up a stream box and I'm waiting on a HDMI switch. Anyway, um, it looks and plays great. Zero issues on the Xbox Series X. Um, there's a little bit missing from the audio, I think. There was some like sound effects that, to me, felt like they could have been more of. Um, but visually, it's stunning. I gotta say, it looks breathtaking. So on a visual, I'd give it like a 10 out of 10. Gameplay, I'm saying like an 8 out of 10. There's some wonkiness to the controls that I'm just gonna have to get over. Uh, I'm not that good at shooting, so I'll probably need to configure the aim assist a little bit more. Um, the controls are a little weird with this stuff going on. Uh, the writing is mid. I'd give that like a 5 out of 10. The voice acting is like a 6 or 7 out of 10. It's not bad so far. Um, I don't know the range of characters that you can get. We've seen four of them so far, if you include Bunny. But I know on TikTok, one of the videos I saw this night was going through everybody in all their different costumes. And I, I felt like there was like 12 or 15 heroes that you could unlock in that video. I don't know how many there actually are. Again, I don't know a lot about this video. But my first impressions are this. It's fun. I wouldn't mind playing more of this. So, here's what you need to do. If you would like to see me stream this. And you would like to see me play this game for the next week or so. And sink my teeth into it. You need to like, you need to subscribe, you need to hit the bell icon, you need to drop those comments down below and let me know. If there's enough interest, then this becomes something that I'll move into the rotation and multi-stream on YouTube and over on Twitch. But it's up to y'all, so just let me know down below. In the meantime, don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell icon so you never miss an update. Don't forget the Patreon and the Discord, and I'll see everybody in the next one. Stay safe, everybody. Happy gaming.